Good afternoon, this is Bill from McConnell Auto Center up in Healdsburg. Wanted to take a quick video here for you of our 2014 Jeep Grand Cherokee Overland. It is in billet silver. It's got the large 20 inch wheels, you can see. Coming around to the back of the vehicle, show you a couple features here. One of the things you'll notice from the key fob uh, is power lift gate. So it's nice, you can open the tailgate without or lift gate without uh, uh, having to reach for the handle. Down below, you have a class three frame mounted hitch with all your wiring receptacles. The little buttons in the back of the bumper are for a reverse sensing system. It's a great feature if you're backing up, it'll tell you if you're getting too close. Get a good idea here for the size is a split folding rear seat in these vehicles. I'll show you some of the features up front here. Close that lift gate. Nice little feature here, it's a proximity sensor. What this means is that the vehicle will sense when the keys are near the car. So you can simply walk up and open the doors without having to use the key to unlock. Uh, the Overlands are all very well equipped. This particular vehicle has the dark charcoal interior. We'll have power seats on both sides. Driver side, this is the uh, settings, so different drivers can put personalize their settings. Power windows and door locks and power mirrors. It's all standard. Inside here, start us up. this off. On the wheel you can notice you have heated and air-conditioned seats. Those were the buttons to adjust. And then also, obviously we muted the music, but the navigation system is all controlled by these various apps down below. So everything is very easy. You just push whatever icon that you want to see and then you can toggle to AM, FM, or Sirius XM radio uh, if you like. Down below, again, pretty straightforward. All your climate controls are located here. This will turn off your parking sensors if you don't want them. This one's a traction control setting. You can turn it off if need be. Uh, there's your knob for the four-wheel drive settings. So you're all set there. Up above, uh, it does have the pano roof. Hopefully you get an idea for that. Great feature adds to the elegance of the vehicle and right now the car has just at 102,000 miles the car is in excellent condition has a ton and is just packed full of luxury and convenience features hope you have a chance to come see it thanks